back with another video good morning so I'm just gonna give a little show of what my little garden looks like mm -hmm. All right. let me just go back where I was I was hand pollinating here with the q-tip <laughs> so I didn't think I thought this one was on its way out and this is my uh, zucchini squash here you hear the crickets over here um so i hand pollinated this one they just keep flowering and then i really don't get much but this one was like looking really sickly and uh yeah i think i probably got like one zucchini off of it over the summer and so because it's early and the flowers open i said let me just come out here with my little q-tip and um hold on a second yeah and hand pollinate my patty pan squash as you can see this one right there it's coming in and there are two flowers beautiful flowers that are already open and so i did that Yeah, so that's what that one's looking like so pretty I just love the big big leaves and my corn we have some husk coming in there's one there there's one right here <laughs> this is my first time growing corn so we shall see we shall see I have to go and grab the sticks today because this one is not with it it's like yep i don't want to be up there i'm gonna go over here <laughs> um these are my russet potatoes and they're starting to die back the leaves but not as much they're still doing its thing going strong the season is still good the weather's good these are my sweet potatoes right here and someone had said to me oh this is not a strawberry plant this is something else and i don't remember what they said in, in another video this is definitely my strawberry plant. I planted it from a little piece of strawberry I cut off. And you can clearly see those would be, all these little spots here would be where my strawberry would be. And they have a whole bunch of runners. There's runners everywhere. There's runners everywhere. All over here. Um, <clears throat> excuse my voice. And so... I didn't get any strawberries this season, and that's okay, because I know I'll get them next year. This one here, I don't really know what they are. Some of these look like squashes. I'm not sure, but I'm going to find out later on today, because I'm going to make this a home for something else, and I'm going to figure that out. Uh, my carrots, these are the Danvers carrots. Those are standing up tall now. I guess they're starting to get bigger. I'm not sure. I planted some rainbow carrots in there, and uh, you see them growing. This is my baby patio eggplants. You see them, they're coming in. The aubergine flowers, they're so pretty. And I don't have any on, is because I just recently harvested from this tree. And that's another pepper plant. That's sweet banana peppers. You got one in there. Let's see, down here, we got my uh, beans. There's more beans. Let's see, which one is this? This is, and this is actually, this is really growing. This is uh, a cucumber. I might not get none for this season, but yeah, this is, I put it in the ground late, but it's definitely growing. <laughs> it's definitely growing. And this is my melon plant, and I, this is like really rough, if you can see it. That's what it's giving me. <laughs> so I don't know. But these are more beans over here. All of these down here, I planted these late, so I don't expect too much. These are, um, I just pulled out of here yesterday. Um, uh my zucchini plant it completely died 
and that's okay but it because it, because it um it did its job it gave me a lot of zucchinis over the summer and i appreciate that now this one that's getting really big is my black beauty eggplant um i'm not getting too many eggplants in here i haven't been able to harvest anything off of them yet um hold on one second but she's in there I only got one there she is and um i don't know how you fell over i'm pretty sure one of these lovely animals said hey and those are my collard greens right there these smell so good oh my goodness this is my tomatillo plant it's getting so big I hand pollinated them yesterday. This thing is huge. Let me just step back a little bit so y'all can see. That thing was so small and it got this big. I, I love it. It's just beautiful. Yep. So that. We got some bell peppers here. Mini bell peppers. They're turning. They went from green. They're turning orange. You can see there's more coming in. Mm -hmm. I have some cabbage. Um, I have to thin some of those out and yeah, that's coming in back here. I have a uh, marigold Yeah That's asparagus. This is all asparagus This is all asparagus. It's huge. Those are the, all the asparagus ferns And uh, yep, you see I have more snap peas over here Mm-hmm you can see the pretty flowers. I have some Swiss chard lettuce all in here. And I have onions. I usually, these onions, these were onion slips I had brought from Walmart. And they didn't do well. So the only thing I really am able to harvest from the onions is the green onions. And that's just what I do. Um, this is lavender. It smells so good. My basil. More, um, why are you in there? You see the onion? Uh, more snap peas. We got onion under there. Just every, every there's a lot of everybody in here. <laughs> uh, this is more peppers. Let's see. We got more Swiss chard down there. And um, this is spinach here. I have to thin that out, and I might get some. We'll see. And these are my tomato plants. I cleaned them up yesterday. So, they're looking pretty bare, but I don't really care about all of that because my household is not big and a lot of things um, don't get eaten and I don't like food to be wasted, but look how pretty. That's one. That's the first one. This is the second one. So, you see, that's a lot of tomatoes right there. I mean, you don't, you don't need a lot, but they're looking bare. You see them. <laughs> They're like, oh, season's changing. This is the third one. And I planted these in mop buckets. Those are from the Dollar Tree. I love my tomato plants. Those are my cherry tomatoes. And here we are, some more collard greens over here. I'm going to be planting more soon. And we got more mini bell peppers. Look at them. Look at them. It's a whole bunch. It's a whole bunch. Right? And these are, let's see, what are we? These are my sweet peppers. These are sweet bell, um, not bell peppers, excuse me. Uh, the uh, banana peppers. I've gotten a lot of these this season. These are my long cayenne peppers. They haven't changed red yet, so I'm trying to leave them on there as long as I can. There's a jalapenos. Um, this is a poblano. Poblano. Let me correct that. But um, I only was able to harvest on that one too. There goes another jalapeno. Yeah, so that's all we got. Y'all see it? And I believe what's today? The um, today is the. This is the. 13th, the 12th or the 13th of September, 2023. I'm going to go and get the, 
the long sticks, the bamboo sticks for that today. I'm going to also be purchasing my little mini greenhouse. It's on sale at Lowe's in my area for 20 bucks, which is a great deal. And I'm just going to start planting. Oh, I have more. Hold on. And my beautiful grass. If you look at my older videos, you'll see me. Um, this spot right here was all like a big dirt patch. And um, I recovered that. So see the difference. And... My grass was just cut yesterday. Then there was a space over there uh, where it was a big patch and everything. And I also, I, I did all of this. I did all of this. This side over here has like a lot, it's, it's a lot better than what it was. But it's more patchy. But I don't really care too much. is because, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to, all this is going to be my garden space. So, yeah, I don't really care. But, so on my porch here, I have some basil. I have more lettuce. This is um, romaine lettuce. Nope, I'm lying. That is the plain Swiss chard. <laughs> um, right here, let me get in here. These right here are um, uh, ginger. I planted it just from a little piece of ginger. I don't know. Is that that right there? Yep, that's the ginger. And this is what I'm getting. And uh, more banana peppers, the sweet banana peppers. Mm hmm and jalapenos so yep I have these just up on my porch and that's basil right there let's see what I'm... and more jalapenos and this is my dill and you see it so I had this is Today I will be uh, saving these seeds for, I forgot the name for this, something like a bowl, like a bloom or something like that. You can look it up, but when it gets to this point, it's ready. Um, you can save these seeds for next season. So that's what I'll be doing today. But uh, as you can see down here, that's the dill. It smells really good. Um, those are ready to be saved. Um, this is what... They look like before that point yeah this is um supposed to be a habanero plant i didn't get any habaneros I'm not tripping about it and these are just some asparagus ferns here and last but not least i have i'm not sure who this person is this one right here but i do have some cilantro going on in here i started i just threw some seeds in here and um mostly like cilantro oregano and like the seeds that you could just grow right in your house and so that's what this little pot is all right so thanks so much for staying tuned if you stayed this long uh please give this video a thumbs up like comment definitely share and subscribe I'm trying to get my followers up my subscribers up on this channel to at least 500 and um with you subscribing would help me so much thank you for liking and showing love and just staying tuned and just going along with me on this journey and starting my garden growing my own food and you should too take care be blessed